MCO Ping Monitor is an agentless network monitoring solution. The program uses ICMP pings to monitor host states and connection quality, and to analyze hosts' performance during a selected historical period. The main screen of the program shows the current state of the entire monitoring system. Here we can see how many hosts are currently being monitored, how many of them are up and down, and how many hosts have different quality characteristics. Detailed information on the state, quality, and statistics is available in corresponding views. The state monitor view shows the current state of the monitored hosts. The states are represented by different colors, so the up hosts are displayed in green and the down hosts are displayed in red. When a host state changes, its color is adjusted accordingly. To display more hosts on the screen, we may switch the view to small pictograms or expand it to a full screen. The hosts are sorted by their names, but we can switch the view to show the down hosts on top. We can also filter data to display hosts with specific characteristics only. So, how does the program detect host states? All hosts are pinged on a regular basis, and if a configure number of pings fail in a row, the host state changes to down. We can click on a host to see its details. Here on the chart, we can see that the last pings failed, and here, we can see the start and the duration of the down state for this host. The quality monitor view shows the current connection quality of monitored hosts. The quality can be good, warning, bad, or critical and it is indicated by different colors so we can easily identify it on a screen. Here we can use the sorting, grouping, and filtering features to display the required hosts only. To see detailed information for a host, we can click it. The connection quality is detected using the results of the latest pings displayed on the chart. Here we can see the customizable conditions used to classify the connection quality. Metrics exceeding the threshold conditions are highlighted, so we can quickly understand why the connection quality is set to its current value. The program settings are customizable, so we can either use common settings applicable for all hosts or specify individual settings for selected hosts and groups. For example, it is possible to tune the monitoring settings to use custom values. We can also configure the program to send email notifications when the host state and the connection quality change. The user interface of the program allows identifying problems on the upper level to drill down to problematic hosts. For example, here we can find hosts that are up but have a bad connection quality, so we can easily find them and see their real-time characteristics. To analyze historical data of the hosts, we can open Statistics. Here we can select the required period to see the host's statistics for this period. We can use the sorting, grouping, and filtering features to organize the display data. We can click a host to see detailed information. The program stores a lot of metrics for every host that are displayed here. The easiest way to assess the host performance during a selected period is based on using the aggregated characteristics displayed here, so we can see if the host performance was high, medium, low, or faulty during the analyzed period. To see all the state and quality changes of a host during the analyzed period, we can open corresponding tabs. Here we can see the time and duration of the host state and quality statuses. The latency and uptime chart shows aggregated data of the corresponding characteristics. The latency chart highlights time intervals during which the host had performance problems, so we can find them easily. The state and quality chart shows how the corresponding characteristics of the host changed over time, so that we can find problematic intervals. We can click on the chart bar to see the timeline displaying all pings during the corresponding time interval. It is possible to export raw ping data into a file. The program can generate reports in different formats. It is possible to generate a report on demand or on a regular basis. We can add hosts to be included into a report. Optionally, we can add a filter to exclude hosts that do not meet certain criteria. Finally, we can select the report format and configure how it should be delivered. The Enterprise Edition of the program works as a client server, so multiple clients can connect to the same server and work simultaneously with the same data. Access Control allows configuring the users who may work with the program and assign different roles to them. The Enterprise Edition also offers a monitoring web interface that provides access to all the monitoring and statistical data and allows starting and stopping the monitoring of hosts and groups. Would you like to try the program now? You can download a free 30 days trial or access an interactive online demo to work with the server that monitors a large network.